that was the first point of the match. was the third point of the match. What's up YouTube? How's it going? Welcome back to today's video. Just a quick introduction and a few things before we get the video started. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. We're going to be doing a reaction style video where I will be doing a little bit of commentary over the highlights that we have for today's match. Now for today's video, we have an impromptu match that I was challenged to against one of our players, Henry Park. Henry is committed to a D3 college, Grinnell College and he's around a 10 UTR. In this video, you'll see that Henry has an amazing all-around court game. He reads the court well, he reads his positioning well, he reads his opponent's positioning well. But from those first few highlights, it's a it's a very physical match between the two of us. But yeah, before we, uh, before we get started with the video, um, comment down below who you think is gonna win this match. And also, before all the internet trolls get to me, I'm not claiming to be good. Never said I was good. So if you see some, if you see some bad plays, it's it's excusable. All right, all right. Let's get to the video. Enjoy the video, guys. All right, first reaction style video. Let's uh, let's get it started. Yeah. So as you saw, um, the first two points were placed at the beginning of the video, and. These were not great points. Um, they're lengthy and the ball's being moved well by Park. But as you can see, I'm hitting the ball way too much in the middle. And in the moment when I'm very, very out of shape, it's probably the worst way for me to play. Um, and you'll hear me make some comments on that. Too short to the middle. <laughs> that was a good get by me. Hey, I'm done after that one. We're good. <laughs> yep, definitely bent over. I'm telling you. Like you played every part of that point correctly, and you still lost. <laughs> Just a little friendly dancer, you know, at this point I know I'm not going to beat him physically, so got to talk a little bit to get in his head, right? Should be sneaking in with a lot of these. <laughs> As you can see, Park is is actively trying to find his way into the net. Um, he does a great job of redirecting the ball, like right there. He also does a great job of neutralizing his line deep. That's a great ball. Hi. It's a good point by me. That's what that is, Park. It's a good point by me. You know, it's very rare. That's a shot I probably should have used more during this match. You'll see him come to net a lot, and a lot of times I go for the pass, but... Good 
too long of a point. Holy cow. It's ridiculous that I know I'm just completely gassed, right? Like the physicality isn't there. We're three games in, and I'm playing a point like that. Smart surf by him, by the way, right there, to know I'm tired, and he just goes out wide and stretches me. But I need to be willing to just step in and swing. And just not think that he's going to make a mistake. Thought I made that one, but Good ball. Great close. That's a picture perfect point by him. So at that point, at this point in this match, I'm thinking he's going to start swinging, right? And so if you play that back, I do a great job of pushing him back, but then I don't ever take space. Meanwhile, I kind of just saw Parker just closing in on him every single time he can. He's trying to close there. Swinging volley next time, Kevin, please. Terrible slice, oh my lord. Gotta work on the slice, that's for sure. Yep. Starting to step in. See that ball? I went for the pass, but I should have went at his chest. Yeah, I knew what I was doing here. I lost Fighting the first time. I'm through my life over here, Phil. <laughs> I'm just gassed. I'm just absolutely gassed at this point. But I should have taken that pat that uh, short ball at his chest and made him play the tight volley again, like I did the last time. Yeah. Too much to the middle. To the middle. Better. Terrible slice. that one on me adding a ton of weight to the racket and not adjusting to volleys. <laughs> Just a few things weren't going my way, but... We did... You hear me say you can play it back. We did, in fact, play it back. And it was definitely a much closer call than you think, but we're just, you know, we're just going to let it play through. So we're going to get our get back. <laughs> I'm going to be very selective about which call I make or when I make the call. Got to be at one of the deuces or game point. Oh! 
So this is um, really quick. This is the start of the second set, and I just got the first game. So Park actually ends up playing a couple of loose points, which he had not done the entire first set. Um, and I do get my looks at a break. And that's that's very important. It's a very important detail. In the comments, I want everyone to go down and tell me what you thought about those two line calls. The first one that I made, let me know if you thought it was out. And that one, that was my break point. He ended up winning that game, so it's one on out because he called that out. He he ended up holding. But let me know what you think about those two calls, please, because me and Park were having the biggest debate about it. Too short. This movement. Park's movement is so good. If you watch his footwork. Yeah. That's a wonderful setup play he did. Instead of driving, he just lifts it deep and then. Open up the court for himself. Maybe hit a weak ball. <laughs> well, that's, that's not the exchange I want to get into. So I'm not going to last if I do that. So at this point, I was thinking I need to play more drop shots, bring him in so I can go for more passes, go for more uh, balls to his body. Um, but I don't I want to hit that drop shot and just keep running more. Yep. I'm starting to swing a little bigger, getting a little more comfortable. Just kidding, that was easy. Yep. <laughs> just completely gassed but I think that's part of it right like I know I need to go into close right now, dude. Dude, I just can't drag it out I know I need to go in to close out the points but also my can't drag it out can't drag it out can't my drag body it out. can't go keep up enough when you're just out of shape right to, to find a way into net so oh. it's just that balance <laughs> terrible balance <laughs> Get more points like that. Should be maybe chip and charging more. Park was getting every net board up until that point. Every single oh. one, every let, every ground stroke. Everyone. Come in. Yeah. That's also a shot that I didn't do enough of. Just taking down line backhands. I think I was way too predictable on the backhand side. Not doing a great job of changing directions. You know? So 
great setup using a three quarter angle shot. And then closing in early, taking on the rise. Except I don't close. I deserve to lose this point if I do lose it. Come in. I love tennis. <laughs> I love this sport. I I should not have won that point. I I mean I played fine. Like I was patient, hit good balls, but. I missed my chance to win it like three or four times, so I should have taken advantage of that. Same thing, great close. Great ball, great strike. Yeah, honestly, I should have been playing more balls at net. You know, I do like balling. I like doubles more than singles, actually. So, I should have been a little more disciplined with that. Yeah, same thing. I should be going high and deep there, trying to neutralize, except I drive short to the middle, and I just give them all the spots to hit. Oh, this one. Terrible swinging ball. Uh, my ankles. I split step guessing that he was going to go line because he's been going line the whole time. And I just uh, pretty much just gambled. Talk about that. Let's cut. <laughs> Same thing, blaming the weight of the racket on that one. Added a lot of weight to the head. Scrambling, just not in shape for it, that's all. I think we were eight deuces in at four all at that point, and that was the worst deuce I could have played. It was every ball to the middle. Yeah. 
dragged the point on way too long. Way too long. And that's it for today's video. If you said that I was gonna lose, you were correct. The final score was 1646. As you saw, Henry just made it a very, very physical match, and honestly, just my body wasn't ready for that. I did my best to stay in every point. You know, I tried to chase down every ball, but at the end of the day, there just wasn't enough in me in my legs to to try to close out points and get into the net, especially on my serve. My serves were very weak, but wanted to treat it all as a building day as there are plenty of tournaments coming during the summer in Seattle that I plan on playing. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Once again, as always, thank you for the immaculate support that we've been getting on the channel. I believe our last video has about 1.5K views at the time of me editing this, so thank you so much. I haven't forgotten what I said, so that video will be coming out shortly. But in the meantime, if you guys are enjoying this channel and my content, please feel free to share and subscribe to it. Otherwise, yeah, we'll see you in the next one.